What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, the Uncrowned Otaku. Oh, oh, oh. Latest chapter of King and Omega came out a couple days ago, and we're finally at the last match. Everything's on the line here. Whoever wins, either Purgatory is going to stay alive or King and Association is going to stay alive. But both can no longer coexist, and it comes down. It comes down to the two perspective captains of the Purgatory team, the undefeated, 422 wins, flawless victory. King of Purgatory, Triple S rank fighter, daughter, the killer of Manila or the monster in Manila, whatever his moniker was. And on the, on the King and Association side, we got our boy, the Ashura himself, Oma, Tokita Oma. And we all know, we've all been waiting for this because the dude on Purgatory side, the king, he's had this like overwhelming pressure to the point that we all just think, you know, maybe nobody can kind of get with this man. Is that truly the case? But almost coming out strong, he's mastered a couple new techniques because, you know, this whole like two year time frame he's been missing. He's been training with the assassin crew, the Kure clan. So now when when Don Air was launching his his like speedy attacks, Oma was already just he was predicting where the attacks were landing and just phasing through all that crap. Now, this video ain't going to be long or anything because that's really all that happened. Eventually, Don Air did get some licks in and he was like, you know, yeah, you made it to that state. But when you're a king like myself, it don't matter. I'm going to still get with you. Caught him with a knee and elbow. Ooh, my elbow a little ashy. All right. But, um, yeah, I'm just, I'm really hyped because we finally, we haven't seen Oma really get busy with anybody of, of worth in two years. So to see how far his level has, has elevated, because what had me hyped was when we were watching um, Kano, the former Fang, when he was fighting that dude, I was hyped. Because I was like, this is a man that we know. Apex Predator, top of his class when it comes to martial arts. Barely anybody can get busy with this dude. People we know are super strong. I love to see them fight. Like the superhuman dude with the, with the claw that was fighting the, the, the wannabe ninja dude, that, that was kind of whack in comparison to everybody else. Now, what we're seeing right now, oh, pure skill. And there's definitely something still in the works. We got the worm and the other Nico back there doing some kind of plan. But that's like the background. I don't want them to focus on that yet. Let me see Oma fight. I want to see who's going to win, Purgatory or Kenyon. That's the whole point of this match. So if, if Worm comes in and interrupts this last match and they just decide, you know, hey, let's call it even. We can, we can both thrive in the underground. I'll, I'll be pissed off. I'll be hot. I ain't going to lie. We got to have a victor. And being honest, completely objective, even though Oma is the hero, I don't see him winning this. The other dude, even even Kano was like, yo, this dude got some skill with that, that pressure. It's a double duty. I don't, I don't think anybody on the king side is going to mess with this man. Oma is really going to have to have like some, some, some severe increased techniques. Even the previous fight. The dude who we thought was going to be the vessel, he was intense. Kind of burned himself out and killed himself. But he honestly could have probably dominated a lot of king and fighters too. So Purgatory ain't no joke. And for this dude to be the king, you already know he ain't no joke. This fight going to be next level. Now we'll see if if Oma has risen to surpass Gensai's level. Kuroki Gensai. I think that was his name. Yeah, yeah. Or, you know... I really got nothing else. I'm kind of trailing off at the end. I'm just hyped for the next fight. Like I said, nothing really happened. I'm hyped for the next fight. King and Omega. Y'all with it? I need y'all to be up on these new chapters. They drop like, I, I feel like once a week, but honestly, if it, it, it might be once every two weeks, but I'm, get with it, please, y'all. It's fire. I'm trying to tell you. Fire matches. Speaking of fire, there it is. Uncrowned Kingdom. It's your boy. I'm out of here.